What up, YouTube? This is your president, the Presidential Terrorist, back with another drink review taste test video. Okay, um, I have something really cool to show you. Um, you might have seen a little bit about it on one of my shorts I filmed. But, yeah, first of all, I mentioned, you ever seen Coca Cola bottles and notice it has a yellow cap? I wonder, hmm, what is that about? Well, you may already know, or you may have seen my short I filmed on it, but that means. This is kosher. Now, I guess kosher, uh, Coca-Cola is kosher all year round anyways. Except, um, it's not fit to be considered kosher enough for Passover. Which, this is why this is created. It's, for, uh, it's created for people who are Jewish to drink it during Passover. That's why it's the little cap. It's marked that. And because it's, um, and I have the information right here. I'm going to put a good article I re uh, read on, on um, on the internet about this explain more better than I could but this is, has their more their original coca-cola's original recipe with sucrose instead of um, the corn syrup and that's what makes it kosher enough to drink during Passover and I'm not going to get too much in um, all the more details about it but I have a link here I'm going to put it below then you can read more about it this video is more explaining why it's yellow, but also a taste test. Now you might think, oh, it's not gonna taste any different. Some says it tastes the same, some says it tastes better. So we will see. I've been wanting to get this and try it for you all for about two or three years, no, three years. I just never seen it. I remember seeing this years and years and years ago and I had no idea what it meant until like three years ago I found out it's because it's specially made to be extra kosher, I guess you could say, for Passover. I just couldn't find it. Um, one thing I know is different this year around, I've seen photos of previous years and it usually would say like kosher right here or something like that. The label isn't, doesn't say anything different about that this time, at least none that I see. Of course the yellow cap and then you see um, some of the symbols right there. See if I can zoom in. There you go. Now I don't know if they do smaller bottles or cans I've only know they ever done the kosher cokes in the two liters and I was able to find diet too so I'm gonna review both of these let's do the regular first and I may get um, some regular coke um, that's not certified to be kosher and I uh, even know it is and maybe do a comparison video uh, with this. I may do that. I just haven't had a chance to pick some up, but we will see. Here goes. Quite excited. It's always, I mean, technically it's not really a new pop, but it sort of is for me. It's kind of been in my soda pop bucket list. But I just to pick up some kosher coke and give it a try. Smells like Coke. Mm. I think it does taste a little different. Um, the sweetness is definitely different. I do actually think it tastes better. I think they're right. I think the ones that says it tastes better is that it's a different kind of sweetener. I think they're right because it just does. I mean, obviously it tastes like Coke, but it just tastes better. It does. I don't, maybe, maybe as I can say it's a little bit more special. I don't know. Yeah, I think it does. I wasn't sure. I thought, oh, it's probably not going to taste any different, but it just does taste better. But this is um, the uh, um, regular flavor, original, I guess. Here it is. <clears throat> and let's try this. This. Now this has aspartame in it. 
wonder how, let's check the ingredients of this one. You see, I don't understand this because this says cane sugar here. Now, the articles I've read said it's supposed to have the sucrose instead of cane sugar. So I'm going to do some more in-depth research about why this is any different from the regular. But either way, it does seem to taste better to me. I'm definitely going to keep these caps. Like I said, I've been trying to find this forever. No, you, mm, it smells like Coke. It doesn't even know it doesn't have a huge smell. <clears throat> mm. Yeah, you know, it does taste better. Maybe it's just a psychological thing. I don't know. But, this seems to taste better to me. Like I said, I'm going to have to do some more research. Because there are a couple articles I read. That's what they said, but it's not what it says here. Or on the bottle of the, uh, the original. I am not an expert on um, kosher food or nothing, so don't go by me. I just finally saw this in the store and I want to try it for you. This is the main thing, reason for this video. This is just to review it. And I have to say, it does like I said, it tastes better. Now this is only around for like a couple weeks and they don't... Um, the store that I went to, I found it at Publix. They probably had between the um, non-kosher ones and the kosher ones. You include both the diet and the regular. Uh, they're probably close to only 20 bottles and a lot more of the regular Cokes, I guess you could say. So I don't think each store gets a lot of them. It's compared to the, the amounts that um, are the regular ones, compared to these ones with the yellow caps, they probably don't make a huge amount of them. Okay, yeah, this tastes better. It actually tastes, I think, almost, I mean, you still have that bit of a diety flavor to it, but you still, this tastes, I think, closer to the original than um, the regular diet. But then again, like I said, it might be psychological. Either way, that's it. I just wanted to review that for you all. Um, <coughs> if you want to try it, get it. Because this time of year is about the only time you find it. I found these probably maybe about a week ago. Uh, I've been sitting on them. I just haven't had time to review them for you. So we're only talking a short period of time. You're going to find them in the store. Like I said, I found mine at Publix. But I can't guarantee if you have a Publix nearby, you're going to find that. Or a regular grocery store. Or other or other grocery stores, I mean. You might not find them there either. So you just got to look around. I remember talking to some to the Coke guys who delivered to it. And they were saying... It's they don't make a lot of them, so that's why you might not see them. And stores have to request them, so I guess mine must have requested them. So, um, so which is good because, like I said, I wanted to review those forever. But um, any consequences, let me know. Actually, you know, wait, before we go, I do have a bottle of Coke here I picked up at Disney. Now let's compare this. Okay, so here's the difference. Now, this is a Coke. For their, um, I bought Disney World. This is um, it's for like their 100th anniversary label. Now it says here, make sure. Okay, one's cane sugar, and the other, oh, okay. High fructose corn syrup, and the other one's cane sugar. So that's the difference. Kind of got a little mixed up. So one's cane sugar, one's, um, so this is the cane sugar, the kosher one. The regular one is the high fructose corn syrup. So this is what makes it kosher is that cane sugar. And as soon as anything else, carbonate water is both the same. Caramel color, faster acid, natural flavors, caffeine. So that's the only difference between the two. 
I may do a video where I do a comparison. I don't... This one's kind of old. I basically only bought it to keep it as a display piece. So I don't really want to open it. Once this expired several months ago, which doesn't stop me from drinking it, but I want to keep it kind of how it is. So I may um, see the next day or two, pick up some regular non-kosher Coke. You know, it is kosher. And maybe do a review video for you all, but i got to buy probably a smaller bottle because I don't get two liters very often anymore. It's a lot of pop to um, for me to drink, keep around. That's why I prefer smaller bottles and cans and stuff. Okay. That is it. I'll put a link to an article below that explains it better than me. What makes it kosher for now compared to the regular Coke, which is also kosher. And it talks about the foods and everything. Anything like that could explain it far better than I could. But any comments, questions, please put them below. I always look forward to talking to you, and hope you all have a nice day. See you all. Yeah.